And besides the snow, fog was a big topic this past January. Meteorologist Scott Munt takes a look at what that could mean for our spring. The warm air, melting snow, and light winds have all been great ingredients to get fog during the morning hours. And for some of us, that's been extending into the afternoon. If you're a believer in the fog theory, you probably already have your calendar marked for April. If you haven't, this is what I have. First of all, here's a list of the foggy conditions reported in Sioux Falls last month. January 1st through the 9th, the 18th and 20th, as well as the 22nd through the 29th and the last day of the month. A total of 21 days out of 31 reported fog in January. 90 days from those dates bring us to things starting on the last day of March through much of April. While I don't expect 20 days of precipitation in April, I will tell you the most days with measurable precipitation in April is 18 days in 2019. Also, part of the theory is the more consecutive days of fog we have, the more extreme the weather can be. So buckle up, April can be a bumpy ride. For Kettle Land Weather, I'm meteorologist Scott Muntz.